What's up, fellas? It's your boy, Frankie M. Back again, guys, with the Nipex. I did a video on this yesterday, you know, that I got in the mail. And I showed you guys the video about these Nipex wire strippers. Um, guys, I went to use them yesterday, and I'm very disappointed on the product. I got some wire right here. I'm going to show you guys why I'm disappointed, okay? So, you stick the wire through. Look at it, guys. Didn't strip it. You guys can see that? Nothing. Okay, I'll try another one. Look at it, guys. Nothing. They're not stripping, so I'll do the other end. So I believe that this is the problem right here. When it clamps down, this is supposed to put a lot of pressure on it. If I hold it, bam. You guys saw that? I'll do it again. Look, push pressure, bam. I didn't even cut it off right. Look at that. Okay. So, that's the problem with these, you know, they're not really well made, quality sucks, I think so, see, I mean, this part works good, stick it in there, that part works good, you saw that, let me try this again, catch it on camera, bam, and then I'll go to use it again, see, you guys see that, right, it's in there. Nope. Look at that. Nothing. So. I really needed these yesterday. I was doing a stereo installation with some speakers. And. Thank God that I took. I brought my other. My Klein wire strippers that I made a video on. That recently. But these things. They suck fellas. So. I know some of you. That saw this video comment on it you know at, i believe juan um he's got a pair i don't know if he's got the same problems the same issues with this but mine are not working i have to put pressure on it in order for it to cut if i don't put pressure they will not cut oh finally cut wow all right let's try it again stick it in there Cut it. I'll do the other one too. Okay. Strip some of this more wire. Now they're cutting. Wow. So. 